How's it going YouTube? Today I got Petrified Fish. It is the PFE08 or the Grow. And they went back to their older boxes, thank goodness. I don't need those pouches. You got microfiber cloth, stickers, and extra hardware. And some candy. That's all. That's all you need. I ordered this from China, so it took 13 days to get here. A little bit quicker than normal. It is Petrified Fish's first button lock. What'd you think of it? I do like the red Jamascus. A lot of companies are starting to use that. <clears throat> now, this isn't my favorite blade shape. Really not in love with this knife, but I had to check it out, buy it anyway. Man, satin just gets all the fingerprints. You got a 3.6 inch K110 blade, satin finish, partial flat grind. Uh, I'd call this a clip point. These are uh, retail for $48.99. But if you bought it on the first three days, you got it 20% off, um, like I did. It does have a designer mark. Looks like a V, but there's no information on the website about who the designer is. So if you know that, leave it in the comments. Got a 3.3 millimeter blade stock or 0.13 inches 8.15 inches overall so it's a full size knife let's go ahead and get the comparisons out of the way petrified fish scholar bossy thunderbird it's about the same size as the thunderbird and the scholar their Gmascus is a little bit better than Vosteed's. You see that splotchiness? It's not on the petrified fish. I'm not dissing Vosteed, I love them. Just dissing that knife. Um. Petrified fish Terra. One of the budget budget models from petrified fish Kaiser Cobalt again they're about the same length give or take a hair and two more since they're out PM2 about the same length and the Sinka Snap which I'll have a video on it the next few days. Yep. PM2 is a couple hairs longer. We'll get into more about the button. But we got T8 screws. I believe this is something new for them. I feel like they haven't been using T8s. I may be wrong, but it's new for them. Knife weighs 3.8 ounces. It does have a weight relief on the inside. You got a non reversible titanium clip. Nice little added touch good tension it'll come to about right there so not too much sticking out of the pocket and as I said you got this G10 G Mascus it's got some milling on it looks good I believe they have it in black and green and just black G10 the black G10 is cheaper 
you got three deployment options. You got your flipper tab, meant for light switch. I also got the button. I messed that up. And you got the thumb stud. You can reverse flick it. Just gotta use your meteor finger. It's not the most comfortable. Um, you have a lantern hole and a backspacer. Black G10 backspacer. You have a decent sharpening tool. They blended it. They blended yeah, the plunge ground in pretty good. You have a few sharpenings. You also have no billboarding. Very small. You got PFE08, K110. And the designer marks the biggest spot. Let's get into the button. If you haven't noticed, this button is small. Close the off up. Beside the Thunderbird, quite a bit smaller. It sticks out not as far either. Even when it's open. Let's check that out. See that? I need to pull out some other button locks. I'm not just ragging on Boss Steve. Alright, I pulled out a few other knives. It's just CJRB Riff. Six out. More. Not a lot though. Let's look at it this way. The riff ain't bad. The original XL. Sticks out quite a bit more. Let's check them closed. It's about flush closed. And the roof is, it's about flush closed. And it's also more rounded over, smooth. And you're not going to hit that while you got it open. Unless you're trying to. Unless you're just like holding your knife like how it shouldn't be held. I can't see you hitting that. So yeah. I'm not going to spine whack it. I don't do that. You can destroy your knife by yourself if you'd like. But no button stick. I think they hit it out of the park. For my dislikes, don't have a whole lot. Um, they didn't put any jipping up here, which, why? Why not? And the thumb studs are right against the knife. So it's not that hard to thumb flip it. It's a little bit hard to reverse flick it. I can't even do it now. Um, I wouldn't mind smaller thumb studs maybe. Uh, a little bit farther down. I don't know. Maybe no thumb studs at all. I don't really know the solution to that. But yeah. I will link this down in the description. Give me a... Uh, Subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a like and a comment and see you in the next one.